you now see a short demonstration of work using energy with one of Mikhail's students. We will try to have Mikhail explain this in the future films. The question asked here is why does the student scream during this work? Mikhail's answer is, this is a fairly advanced student and he realizes the danger behind the movements very quickly and the way his body expresses the fear is by screaming. You will now see a literally breathtaking lesson on punches and how to take them onto the body. Every man in our group gladly volunteered to go through this tough experience. Not just to feel the strikes and a way to handle them, but also to feel how Mikhail removes the pain and restores balance at the end of each session of strikes. The training here is to deal with the strike by exhaling and flexing the front and back muscles of the body. This way, you do not let the strike penetrate and do damage, and it teaches you to overcome the fear of contact. Now see a demonstration of uh, short punches. <laughs> These strikes magically made Jerome speak Russian. One of the starting exercises for psychic energy is called heavy hands. The weight of the hands here is not physical. The energy that fills the hands and then the partner makes him go down. of keeping the spine straight. 
he constantly teaches the body to relax and yet maintain the alignment. Even a small deviation from the straight line puts you off balance and enables the opponent to control you. No matter whether you're standing, falling, or in any other position, the goal is to keep the form of a straight spine. See how much pressure a person can take if the back is straight. And if it's crooked, <laughs> so, so if the back is straight and you're getting pressure on it, then he can just stand. But once it's off the alignment, then it's really easy. Jerome lives and works in Paris, France. He has studied and taught martial arts for years, and now he's experiencing a new world in the hands of the master. <laughs> As soon as he makes contact, you give him support and then he uses that. He takes away. That makes sense. What is one? Okay, Lower your Thank you. 
playing so well. He's playing on the structure. And it's so easy for him. He's seeing tense areas. And he's playing with the structure and the balance. What's this point? Is it clear? Ну, что когда он ровный, да, позвоночник, вот я на него давил, он держит, чуть-чуть голову, так, и все. И он... So when the spine is straight, no matter how much he pushed, the control could keep the balance. As soon as the spine is twisted, he moves it. Okay, this exercise uh, for spine and for legs too. It's exactly this exercise. Remember you asked some exercise? Yes. That's so pushing down on the body. Pushing down, yeah. Mm -hmm. See how the back moves uh, completely separately from the uh, hips or <coughs> lower back. Yeah. Oh, my legs <laughs> Here is another demonstration of work against kicks and strikes. Mikhail's goal again is to relax the partner by contacting the tense areas in his body. <coughs> We are now 71 kilometers north of Moscow in the Troitsa Sergeyeva Lavra. La
to working with Michael, I, uh, him moving me around, I, I feel that my body was tight and, and he's, uh, he's telling me how I should move to, to make it softer, so it's, it's good. So I think um, uh, I'll just have to keep, try and keep the mobility going. Uh, um, reading a person's uh, um, body movements and 